We're going on uh, one of those things. It's been a while. Uh, we're heading up to central Queensland. It's been probably, I don't know, years since I've been on a plane. So why are we going up there? Yeah, so my dad lives up at, um, yeah, Yapoon area. So I thought it would be cool to bring Harry along and uh, show him what it's all about up there. And if we do something different, should be good. Let's get on the plane. Sun's coming up. That's the boys. Oh, how cool is that though? <laughs> Man, first look at the water, let's get over here. Holy hell, this is so different. Wow, beautiful tropical trees. I mean, that's what it feels like anyway. The pen, is it the pandanus tree? This is different, man. I haven't been to central Queensland before. So, man, this is an adventure. Holy hell, I'm excited, let's get out there. This is Marky Mark. Hey, man. <laughs> Joey's old man. So sick that we flew up. With all this gear. So the Yapoon area has like a whole bunch of islands off the coast, which is just something so cool about Queensland compared to New South Wales, what we're used to. There's islands everywhere, so we just wanted to head out there and explore. Marky Mark took us out here on his little flat bottom tinny. Are. It's got these tubes on the sides to keep it real stable. It's starting to float over the reef now. Look at it. Not like Sydney. But yeah, weapon of a boat and, and Marky Mark was just a, a legend here. He's learning how to film <laughs> right there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Go hard boys. We're on boys. We're on. Here we are. We're out here. What feels like in the middle of nowhere. There's islands all around us. Yeah, first time in central Queensland. The boys are on. Ark's on it. This is it folks. This is the pinnacle of spearfish. You might not look like it. Forget the doggies. It's getting into a spot. A new spot. That you've never dove before for the first time and seeing what's around that's the pinnacle that is the moment that's my favorite moment and look see this new gun i'm loading it with a load assist as it is a bigger gun a 120 uh rabbi stealth x and usually I only tell the people who wait to the end of the video but this is too big there might just be a giveaway with this gun if you stick around to the end. Anyway, this is my first time in many, many years sneaking up to Queensland where there's coral reef and such different structure than this, like we get in Sydney. And these thorn gardens, I, uh, I like to call them, they're just beautiful, beautiful structure. You gotta watch out for them. And there's little coral trout that were just all hanging around in those little divots. So I went back down and keep looking and one of those famous big cray rocks, Man, they look cool. I, I hadn't really, oh, yeah. So you gotta watch out for those. <laughs> um, and I don't like the idea that you can damage the reef. So you actually do need to be careful of that. I did have to check myself there. But man, these, these, these big cray rocks are so cool. So different to what we see around Sydney. And me and Joey, we were lucky to be able to get up here with all the lockdowns. We snuck in between them. Joey actually saw a cold trout in here. He's just, there he goes. He just took a shot and, well. Hey, in our bucket, there's a torch. So uh, a shot in that cave with that kind of structure. Yeah, that's right, you need a torch because it's gonna be wrapped up, reefed up in there. And um, look, I don't wanna spoil the story, so, but. I shot a big trout and as soon as I shot it, it went really deep in this cave. And if you do like this content, you know, traveling around, then do sub up and run that like bar up. It keeps me fired up for more. He's playing games. Anyway, finally, he gets it. There it is. The first trip of the first trip of the trip, the first fish of the trip. Oh man, so cool. Got it, finally. Bit of a mission. Have we got there? Oh, nice fish. Yeah. So we moved spots, eh? We decided to go out somewhere deeper now that we're feeling a bit more relaxed. And yeah, you can see it's a bit fishier. Second spot, Joey does first drop, moves the big. Joey here, second spot, just shows me up again. I tell you, I was I was feeling like a bit of a nupty here, but stoked for him. It's a nice fish, mate. This is me. What am I saying? Oh, no, no, a wongy, big cod, little cod. And Ray, look at them, they just sit under the sand. Look at those two little remora as well. 
this. Oh, Red Emperor, the dream, boys, the dream. That's what we want to see, but too small, eh? That looks hell promising, eh? That's like kind of a oh, spawning congregation. There's a bunch of parrots in there. Queenies, they're like the Australian salmon of Queensland, but um, yeah, then we just parked up for lunch, hey, good with the shade cloth over the top to get some R&R &R and watch these two carry on. It's true, you and Steve always come down here fishing, me to come up here one day, hello Mr. Trout, <laughs> bye! Ah. <laughs> it's on! It's on. All right, come on, time to test out this, this gun that you could win if you're at the end of cross. Such nice terrain. Just look at it. A little flat though, like for what we're looking for. Damn, this stuff is cool. It's probably bad, but I just kind of get a bit curious to be honest, but these things and what they touch, they feel like. I shouldn't do that, should I though? Tell me. Hold up, hold up, this is what we came here for, stop it. This is a similar spot where Joey is now to where I shot that tusky just then. You can see fish scattering everywhere and you got to keep a lookout, look for those shadows of the fish that you really do want in the background. He's on it. Oh, cool. damn. <laughs> Him straight through there. Oh, I thought you were Joey then. Him. Oh, really? Yeah, no, nah, there we go. That's me. Yeah, no, it's you, coach. <laughs> nice man, another husky. Well done. Oh, cheers. How nice is this, man? Just palm trees, coconut. Oh, nice. Dinner's going to be quite nice tonight. Tuskies, cold trout, thanks to Joey. He was the whisperer today. He got a couple. Maybe that's me tomorrow. We'll see. It's so beautiful. Back at the Marky Mark Park, he's got his mate here, Greeny, who lives with him and, you know, some of his rent's subsidised because he fillets all the fish when he gets back from a day out at the reef. So, um, it, was, it was unreal to have someone do this. It's so meticulously too. Look how good at that filleting is. It's not that good sometimes when you're um, absolutely cooked. All right, that and a big fish feast is how this day ends. But as promised, I'm giving away this 120 Rowdy Stealth X roller gun. I've only used it a few times. Love it, but I do want to give back and I'll explain why soon. In the meantime, head to my Insta for how to win this bloody deadly piece. See you tomorrow.